Hey, it's a great day in Oklahoma. We're in the town of Miami. Right now we're on Route 66. This is the original 1926 alignment here on Main Street. We're headed down to the towns of Narcissa and Afton. We're taking the famous Ribbon Road, the nine foot road. We have some old relics out here. It's Knott's Grocery on the right. Over here is an old relic, gas station probably. Look at this cool building. The Ottawa County Conservation. This is the Neosho River. A little bridge headed over here. And then we head up to the Ribbon Road. Beautiful. We've got some cool things on the left here. The City of Miami Parks and Recreation Department Municipal Fairgrounds. Here, it's called the Expo Building. We've got a great track here, stadium, whole field. A beautiful little home, kind of looks like a cottage style gas station. Now this is our 1926 alignment of Route 66 here. We're headed down to East 130 Road. Then we'll hang a right which is to the west. It takes us on the Ribbon Road. Watch out for the stop signs, because they don't paint stop in the middle of the road like other states. It's a pretty house with a local sandstone, draft style design. So Route 66 comes to a dead end up here. We'll take a right on East 130 Road. Absolutely fantastic. We're headed westbound here on East 130 now on Route 66. The road here gets a little narrower. What happens here is over years and years the road here gets kind of repaved or re-asphalted where they lay on new gravel kind of jacks up the road here. Right now it's a little bit wider still than nine feet, but it narrows up as we get further down. The road out here is all windy and twisty. It's because the road here, a long time ago, before Route 66, is a dirt road. It just ran the uh, along the farms here. Every now and then here, see the original Route 66 kind of pops up through this little gravel paved road here. Up ahead is called Road 540. Here you want to make a sharp left on Route 66 here and it gets a lot better. And here's where we enter our nine foot wide ribbon road. Let's take a look at this. Absolutely gorgeous but it's all chewed up here a little bit. With lucky we'll be able to see the curbs on either side. So the original road here was only nine feet and there was no margin or boundary. Those were added a little bit later for uh, you know protection. Little farmhouse here. And along this road there's a couple little sections that are still pure Route 66. foot patch along the road. If we're lucky you see the little curb lines on the side. This gets narrower and narrower. Yeah, this is absolutely beautiful. 
not rain last night, so the road really got clean for us today. It's a nice little surprise. road here is a super nice treasure we have. One of the few parts of Route 66. Look at the road here. See how narrow that is? We'll find another narrow strip up here. We'll slow down real fast. I'll show you. Okay. So as you drive right on in the nine foot section here, you can see where the road kind of drops off on the right with those little curb lines. And on the left, see a little bit too but this is as wide as the road was back then see they didn't have enough money to make a two-lane road so they made a one-lane road and then if cars came toward you you'd have to call and pull off to the side of the dirt yes yeah, beautiful we're gonna head right here this is called East 140 Road. It's our Route 66, but it looks like they got a bunch of gravel here. Anyway, we're going to pull up right up here. It's a perfect little section of there. the Ribbon Road right here. Check that out. Just gorgeous. I'm going to get out of the car and we're going to take a better look. Hey, I'm going to pull over and walk because just look at this beautiful road. Holy smokes. This is called East 140 Road to our original Route 66. Right here. Looks like a little asphalt on top though. A little bit of gravel. Here are the curbs they have right there. Every now and then we get a section of curb that's kind of broken off because bigger trucks come by or maybe the road crew damages it. So this thing is only nine feet wide here. See that? And if a car was coming towards you this way, you'd have to pull off in the dirt. This was not here back then. It's just all dirt and mud. This little section here, the little margin, was added later. Just gorgeous here. But it is a little bit torn up. See a larger curb up here. Kind of even comes up above the little margin on the side of the road for the shoulder. So all throughout Route 66, this is probably one of the best parts of the road, unless you find a little offshoot somewhere in front of somebody's house where the road was rerouted. And this will match up with the 1937 road, a realignment up ahead. Anyway, it kind of breaks apart here, which is a real shame. We have a, some cows out here. Look at those guys. It's like a calf. It's all farmland here. So, I tell you what, if you ever get the chance you're out here in Miami or Narcissa or Afton, Take this little stretch of road. Just gorgeous. But I did tell you, it's kind of breaking up here. And see this right here? It's now it's just gravel and dirt. So I'm gonna hop back in the car and we'll head out to uh, Highway 69. Hey, look at all these cows here. And they're all running up to me. Either they think I'm going to feed them, or they're going to jump the fence and run me over. Alright, so we're just going to drive down to the end of this road. Here we go. Just imagine driving your old Model T or 49 Ford. Chrysler out here. 
100 years ago, almost, for Route 66. That'd be nice if they had one section where they closed out the margins and actually had a real nine foot section. It's gonna feel hard as to drive in a nine foot section of road here. Now up ahead, we're gonna hit Highway 69, straight ahead. But just on the left, there's a little turnout road curved around as the original Route 66. Ah, check this out. Just gorgeous. A little bumpy though today. So here we go to the left, right here. Follow the ribbon. This is the ribbon road where it ends. This is Highway 69. Hey, this is just absolutely beautiful. So out there is Miami. We headed down here to Highway 69, where Route 66 used to cross over to the farmland out there. Then it matches up again down by Narcissa. Little plaque or marker here, Route 66 in Oklahoma. It's called the Ribbon Road or the Sidewalk Highway. Completed in 1922, it's a federal highway project. It runs 15.46 miles from Miami to Afton, or Miami to Afton. So we're about halfway right now. It's the only remaining nine foot section of the original pavement on old Route 66. It was taken out of commission in 1937 for the realignment. It's on the National Register of Historic Places. So. So here's the original road right here, right there with the little curb here. And that's a bunch of asphalt laid over the road, you junk it up. But it's really nice to preserve this thing. So it's going away every year, it gets a little worse, but they clean it up and try to do their best, keep it safe, but also trying to keep the history of this beautiful road intact. All right, so we're headed down to uh, Narcissa now. We'll hook up to the other section of our uh, ribbon highway, our ribbon road, the sidewalk road here. This is 69 and then it kind of veers to the right towards Narcissa. All right, thanks for watching my video. Have a great day. Bye.